Hello, my friends. Join me today for an invigorating Qigong practice that will work your whole body with a special focus on the lower back, hips, and knees. Go ahead and get ready, and let's begin. Begin in a standing position with your feet firmly planted all on the ground. Soften your knees, relax your hips, tuck your tailbone a little bit forward to help you relax your lower back. Keep your lower back nice and neutral for the entire duration of the class. Your spine is nice and straight, your shoulders relaxed. Allowing a little bit of space under your armpits, soften the joints in your arms. Bring your chin slightly in to open through the back of the neck. And mentally reach upwards as high as you can through the crown of the head. Opening through the entire spinal column. At the same time, establishing your roots, feeling grounded through your feet. We'll begin with a couple of deep breaths to settle in. Breathing in through the nose. An easy long exhale. Inhale in through the nose. And exhale. Letting the air flow naturally in and out. Exhale. Minimize tension, discomfort in the body. Exhale. And again. Exhale. From here, come up on your toes, switch into a normal breath. Begin to warm up your feet and your ankles. One more time. From here, folding in the hips, bending the knees, sliding down, gently coming up, keeping the lower back nice and neutral, folding in the hips, activating the knee joints. Keep the movement fairly easy, stress-free, making sure you feel the activation in your joints more than in your lower back. Very good. From here, coming down again. And we're going to circle the knees six times outward. Last one. Change direction six times in. Keep it slow. Keep it gentle. Just warming up the knees. Good stuff. And last one. Make it straight. Gently push your knees out. Open up. Forward, head up, stand up. Adjusting your feet if you need to. Hands on the lower back, hip rotations.
So here, begin to pay attention what you experience around your hip joints. Feel the muscles, the connective tissues. Feel the internal movement, if you can say that. The movement of blood and fluids and energy. Meanwhile, your palms are bringing warmth to the lower back, especially comforting in the morning. When you're ready, change direction. Keeping the movement nice and round without skipping the corners. Very good. The lower back feels a little warm already. Good. Come back. Gently comfort your lower back, stimulating the points located along the spine. And brush down. From here, get yourself on one leg, using your arms and the hands for balance if you need to. Six times, circle outward. And then six times, move it back. Remember to follow your own rhythm, follow your own pace. Very good. Last one. Make sure you feel nice and steady. Repeat the same. <laughs> and even grounds, making it more challenging. Good stuff. Last one. Take a quick break, circle back. A useful tip is find a point somewhere on the ground ahead of you and concentrate on that point will make you feel more balanced. Shake, 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 free up. Lots of space, lots of room in your joints, good circulation. And then adjusting your feet, coming into the Wuji stance. From here, moving it together, actually, for the next one, we're going to open and rotate the arms. Inhale on the way up, exhale down. The key to this exercise is to keep your lower back nice and neutral, fully relying on your legs, building that strength, exercising the muscles, tendons. And again, exhale. Switch directions, inhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale. Two more. Well done. Give yourself a little break, relaxing the muscles of the legs and the lower back. And then overhead, opening sideways, whipping below. Resilient, flexible, supple tree in the wind. Breathing in, breathing out. Feeling your spine nice and supple, feeling your shoulders, 
nice and mobile feeling the circulation traveling through your body feeling the energy good once more on each side breathing in breathing out Fantastic. Coming back, arms traveling down as we soften the entire body. From here, go ahead and step forward. Comfortable step allows you to shift effortlessly from front to back. Open up. Here, your focus area is primarily the front of the body and the chest. As you shift back, your focus area is the lower back, the main main, and down the back of the legs. Inhale, open up. Exhale, shift back. This exercise helps to regulate the two main meridians that actually govern the circulation of yin and yang energy in the body the one that runs down the front of the body and the one that runs down at the back right down the center inhale open up feel a pleasant stretch shift back last one Bring your feet together. Step on the other side. Exhale. Nice. Two more. Inhale. And exhale. Just take a moment here to notice and observe. Relax in the lower back. Relax and into your stance. Keeping your spine nice and long. Open through the back of the neck. Crown of the head reaching tall. Feel all that energy circulating within you. Feel your feet grounded. Feel your chest open. Feel your palms nice and warm. Feel your spine strong and supple. And then take a nice deep breath in. And overhead. Push upwards, stay on the ground, elongating through your spine. That's your exhale. Inhale, gathering the chi from above and let it settle, sending it downward. Repeat again, breathing in, open yourself up. Exhale, gently lift in the sky, opening up. Inhale, drawing the energy from the sky. Exhale, settling. And one more time, open up. Taking fresh cheer. Exhale, elongate. Inhale, gathering. Exhale, and washing over the entire body. Then draw your hands to place on your lower belly. Feel free to close your eyes. Deepen your breath. Allowing the entire body to relax, the mind to let go. 
the feeling of vitality, health circulating within ourselves. And a couple more deep breaths in. Release your hands. And finish your practice. Thank you for joining me for this short, invigorating routine. And as always, if you got value from this video, don't forget to support the channel, subscribe, share with your friend, and don't forget to activate the notifications to make sure you will not miss any future videos or uploads. Until next time, I wish you great health and keep on practicing.